It is the number one cause of death in the U.S. One local family knows it all too well, the impact heart disease can have. And after receiving a heart transplant uh, at just 15, Candace Monroe's heart beats with gratitude. Austin Love has her story. My perspective on life has completely changed. Candace Monroe has a deep appreciation for life. Thankful, because she knows that all days are not guaranteed. I just keep thinking my life has a purpose because of, you know, I'm still here. She was just 15 years old when she was conditioning to run track in high school. She had shortness of breath and flu-like symptoms. Just never got better. Um, so, you know, went to the doctor, was misdiagnosed twice. My feet were so swollen from retaining water. They were the size of little footballs. Candace was rushed to Cleveland Clinic where she was diagnosed with cardiomyopathy and was told that she needed a new heart in order to live. Devastating news for a 15 year old to hear, but it's news the Monroe family has heard before. Back in 1993, when Candace was just seven years old, her older sister Patrice was 13. She was given the same news. Both received heart transplants before they were the age of 16. Their father, Kevin, the same story. Three heart transplants in one family. You know, my life, my, my family's life has completely been impacted by heart disease. Both Patrice and Kevin passed from their heart conditions, Patrice in 2017 and Kevin last October. While their lives were cut short due to heart disease, Candace continues to be thankful for the time they did share. It's twofold, right? I would do anything to have my sister and my father back, but I was able to have, a, you know, if you think about from the start of our heart journey in 93, I was able to have 27 years with them. Time that was prolonged due to medical advancements made by organizations like the American Heart Association, a cause that Candace has now dedicated her life to supporting. And initially, doctors told Candace her heart transplant would last 10 years. Today, she's going on 20 years and a heart that continues to beat full of gratitude. So, you know, going on 20 years, I'm just like, I can't believe it. And I continue to say I have a purpose and maybe that purpose is sharing my story um, but whatever it is I'm so thankful to be here yeah and C Candace really credits the American Heart Association with giving her extra time she was initially given 10 years with that first heart transplant and then was now going on over almost 20 years with that current heart that she got back when she was 15 16 age and then she also credits them with giving her extra time with her sister and her father as well uh, Dave and you know such a tough story to hear but just the um, the gratitude that she has just for that time just a great perspective that she has and currently she's working with American Heart Association and their leaders for life campaign raising money and awareness for that. So we'll have a link for that on our website, WKYC.com. Yeah, awesome. What a story. Thanks for sharing. And the gratitude, like you said, that really jumped out listening to her. And boy, she just has uh, so many uh, wisdom, so much wisdom with her and looking ahead.